Watch these China's driverless vehicles in action. Hi, good day to everyone. This is Arthur. And of course, this is Richard Aguilar. And we are back again with another awesome video. But before we get started, always don't forget to subscribe and push the bell icon for you to always be updated with our new videos. From driverless taxis to self-driving smart trains, autonomous vehicles will change the nature of on-road driving and in the process, revolutionize the automotive and mobility industries. And now, China's driverless vehicles have been gaining popularity over the past few years. So in this video, you will see exactly how these autonomous vehicles are becoming so popular in China now. Alright, without further delay, let's get started with our number one. Number one is Self-Driving Vehicle as Technology Innovation in China. Take a ride on a self-driving vehicle and get the hands-off experience of China's tech innovation. A former executive at Intel Labs China started his company with a focus on self-driving, which less than a year later unveiled its futuristic driverless vehicle at the CES show in the US. Number two is autonomous driving industry booms in China's Greater Bay Area. As the Greater Bay Area in South China is now home to more and more booming cutting-edge industries, the autonomous driving industry is flourishing and bringing new hope to the region's future economic growth. The Nansha district of Guangzhou City in Guangdong is one of several pilot free trade zones in southern China's Greater Bay Area, where the autonomous driving vehicles have already been running on open roads for over a year and a half. Number 3 is Self-Driving Car Passed Through World's Longest Sea Bridge This is very stunning. Dozens of self-driving cars pass through world's longest sea bridge on Lunar New Year's Eve. The Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge is the world's longest oversea bridge. These self-driving vehicles were powered by Baidu's Apollo technology. Number 4 is China unveiled driverless car completely remote controlled over 5G.
a remote control system that uses advanced 5G mobile networks to operate a car, has taken pole position in the race for attention at the 2019 Shanghai Auto Show. China's state-owned telecoms company, China Mobile, showcased the autonomous vehicle technology, which allowed a driver at the Shanghai show to take the wheel and control a car more than 1,000 kilometers away in the capital, Beijing. Number 5 is Driverless Street Sweepers Put Into Use in Shanghai A pair of driverless street sweepers have been put into operation in an industrial park in Shanghai. The two sweepers have a high working efficiency and are capable of finishing and cleaning work at the industrial park less than 20 minutes. The sweepers are equipped with radar sensors and artificial intelligence systems to help them avoid obstacles, pass through traffic lights, and park at the designated spots. Number 6 is Driverless Vehicles Arrive at a Port in East China Intelligent Container Vehicles made their first appearance at Qingdao Port in Eastern China. Fao, China's largest heavy truck manufacturer, successfully developed the L4 series of smart vehicles, which are designed for port operations. The driverless vehicle, along with its smart system, will not only cut down on labor, but also reduce the potential risk of accidents. Number 7 is, watch how do the driverless vehicles deliver packages. This delivery vehicle is driverless. It is equipped with multiple vision, sensors, and radars. It can identify traffic conditions and calculate the shortest route. It measures about 1 meter long, 0.8 meter wide, and 0.6 meter high. It is controlled by a specific app. It has 6 compartments of different sizes for packages. The customers claim their parcels by inputting codes. Number 8 is Self-Driving Smart Trains on a New High-Speed Line in North China A high-speed railway linking Beijing and Zhangjiakou has started debugging. Now self-driving smart bullet trains have also joined the debugging. The trains have reached a highest speed of 350 km per hour. The trains were designed on the basis of China's Fuxing bullet trains. The smart trains can start, run, and stop automatically. The trains will be the first of its kind capable of speeds of up to 350 km per hour. And that concludes this video for today. 
Don't forget to like this video, subscribe and share this with others. Once again, this is Arthur. And of course, this is Richard Aguilar. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching, watching and have a wonderful day. day.